engineering. I'm studying uh, in fifth semester mechanical engineering. And um, today I'm going to show you how to determine the flash point and fire point of any given oil sample using Cleveland's apparatus. And so this is the apparatus. And this is the thermometer. And this is the stop clock. And this is the fire source standing. And this is the given uh, oil sample, which is diesel. Before you use the apparatus, make sure that the apparatus is completely clean and uh, you can see the groove that is given over here. So you gotta pour the oil sample until that groove, exactly to that groove. So let's pour the given oil sample. So now the, the oil is in the apparatus. So we gotta place a thermometer to take the readings. So while you place the thermometer, make sure that the thermometer is not touching the bottom half. So now the apparatus is plugged in and let's turn on the heater. So now the heater is on. So as the temperature rises, the thermometer indicates it. So let's take a small stick and uh, light up the fire on it. So we should uh, take it around, make sure you don't touch the, um, the fuel, so just take it around like this, as the temperature rises there will be a flash, so right now the temperature is around, uh, it's around 30 degrees, so there is no flash, so you gotta be entering it in your tabular color. So you should be reintroducing the flame at regular intervals. As the uh, oil heats, the vapors of the oil will start catch the fire. So at one point there will be a flash. So you gotta keep reintroducing the flame until you get the flash point. Yeah, there was a flash. So once you get the flash, you gotta note the temperature. I got it at 50 degrees. And uh, so now uh, you gotta take it. And, uh, and once it completely catches on fire, you gotta note down the temperature. It's at 56 degrees. So that is how you note down the flash point and the fire point using Cleveland samples. So this was the Cleveland experiment. Um, so when you notice the fire for just a fraction of a second, it's called as flash point. When the oil sample catches completely on fire, it's called as fire point. So with the help of the thermometer, you should note down both those temperatures. And that is how you determine flash point and fire point of the um, any given oil sample. Um, so this is the Cleveland experiment. So stay tuned for uh, future experiments.